This video is to show you all of the amazing resources that go along with the vocabulary video for the teacher and their students. Next to the video, you'll see the lyrics button on the left hand side. You can click the lyrics and see all of the lyrics in the vocabulary words highlighted in the lyrics. You can also play the song while reading the lyrics. When I exit out the lyrics, I'm able to see the video again. There's also a quick review here, and I'm able to quickly review what we learned in the video with my students. It'll show me the answer right after, and I can keep going to the next question and have a review after we watch the video. There's also this Discuss tab that you can put on at any time during the video. You could play it first without the Discuss tab and then add the Discuss tab for the second viewing, or you could add the Discuss tab during the first viewing. I'm going to click on the Discuss tab. I'm going to move forward in the video. And once I play the video, once it gets to the stopping point, it'll ask probing questions. I can ask this out loud to my students. If I don't like a particular question, I can just resume the video or jump to the next question. These are already pre-populated for each video, so you don't need to come up with the questions yourself. In addition, at any time you can see up here, I can change the speed. When I click here, original speed, which is the default, I can make the video slower and even slower. There's also a lot of other amazing resources when I click on teacher resources on the top of the video. Here it'll give me an overview of the video along with the vocabulary words that are included in the video. When I click on handouts, there's a printable activity that I can download that comes with an answer key. And I also have handouts that go along with all the interactive activities that I can print out for my students. When I click on standards alignment, I can see all of the alignments for the video. Thank you for watching.